Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I wanted to share with you how to make this paper heart stoppers. They're actually really easy to make. First, I'm going to be making a template of heart. I'm going to be drawing half of a heart on a piece of paper, but not just your typical heart shape, but just longer. Then I'm going to cut that and that should give you an even heart shape. So that's my template. I'm going to be taking a piece of red paper and I'm going to trace the shape of my heart like a few times, just following the shape. And then I'm going to cut those. I'm going to be folding that like this, like an accordion. I'm going to be doing this like the entire heart in some. And in some others, I'm going to be cutting inside, which I'll show you in a second. But first, I couldn't find a shape pink that I liked. So I'm going to be making my own. For that, I'm going to be using another piece of red paper. And I'm going to pretty much paint it with some white and red acrylic paint. It's really easy and you can just customize it to whatever shade of pink that you like but yeah i'm gonna be painting my red paper giving this three coats until it's like pink i'm gonna be uh, waiting for that to dry i'm going to be tracing all my hearts and cut them and in some of them i'm just gonna cut them and i'm just gonna leave them like the entire heart and in some others as i mentioned before i'm gonna be cutting inside of it just just so that i have only the edges of heart so i'm just gonna be tracing just an edge then i'm gonna be cutting that and then I'm going to fold it, just pretty much folding the edges of this. I'm going to be using a pin, then a sewing pin, and then a toothpick. I'm going to be first using my pin to just mark where I'm going to be making those holes. It's easier to do it this way and just going by like fold, working in like parts. And then once I've done that, I'm going to be taking my sewing pin because that one is bigger, just to make my holes bigger, like gradually. And then uh, finishing with my toothpick. And then once I'm done with my toothpick, I'm just gonna arrange as I want it to go. That's it for the like entire hearts. For my edge hearts, or the ones that I have nothing in the middle, I'm just gonna be doing the heart at the bottom. To like display them, you can use cupcakes, you can use cakes, you can use any dessert that you want. I just wanted to show you with uh, Oreo cookies because we have a ton of them. And just to show you that you can use any dessert that you want or that you have and if you're choosing to work with our cookies this is how i'm making the hole just so that you don't break the cookie first i'm going to be making the hole with my toothpick going like slowly just trying to not break the cookie and then just place in the topper but yeah guys this is a really simple cute affordable idea to decorate your cupcakes cakes cookies chocolate even pretty much any dessert or any like snack that you want to go for i just want to show you an easy way to just decorate them but yeah hopefully you like these hearts and found them easy to make i actually really like them and they are really easy to make you can make a bunch of them ahead of time and hopefully you like them too if you did don't forget to give this a thumbs up check out more easy toppers and desserts uh, that i have on my shelf scarf for more let me know what you think of this one and share this thanks so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye guys